All right, guys, how's it going? Now, don't forget, I'm hosting a live stream on here this afternoon at 1 p.m. UK and also 7 p.m. UK this evening. And on Saturday, we're having our Cop Talk Christmas party. If you're not doing anything, that'll be in the afternoon after the Merseyside Derby. I'm sure it'll be very sensible. How are you doing? You all right? So I'm catching up on a few things. I went to England at the weekend to see my girlfriend. I'm back now, so I'm like a little bit behind on a few things. Um, there were some claims over the weekend that originated from France claiming that Mo Salah was in contract talks uh, or contract negotiations, if you like, with uh, PSG. Um, and in this article by Le Quib, uh, which is a very speculative publication, um, they uh, quoted a source as saying um, it's very possible that this could happen. Now, I think, you know, we've seen more links with, with PSG before. And, and I think previously there might have been a bit of truth in that. I'm not so sure that that's the case at the moment. I think this is agent talk. So it didn't come as a surprise to hear that PSG are downplaying that and saying we're not in talks with uh, Mo Salah. Do you know what I mean? Uh, and it wouldn't surprise me if the source is um, Rummy Abaf. What's he called? Run, run Abaf? Ram Abaf? Rami Abbas, Mo Salah's agent. Uh, it wouldn't surprise me if he's the source uh, because uh, he's getting nowhere with the, um, the contract uh, negotiating with Liverpool. Richard Hughes at Liverpool, Michael Edwards above Richard Hughes. They're digging in uh, big time on the negotiations on the on the contractual front of um, of all of them. Trent Alexander Arnold, Mo Salah, Virgil Van Dijk. I do think I still think all three will sign. You have to have a little bit of reservation with uh, Trent, but I think that is I, I think that only happens. Trent to Real Madrid if Real Madrid come desperately for him. And it doesn't sound like that's been um, on their agenda. I don't feel like Real Madrid are desperate for him. If anything, they have a short list of uh, options for that position. But he would be an attractive one in terms of uh, how much it would cost to make that um, operation happen. They call it an operation, to make that operation happen. Uh, and for those of you that haven't followed my, my videos for a long time, the, the 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 general vibe over here in Spain is that Trent is very good going forward, but he's nobby, maybe not a great uh, nobby, maybe not a great uh, defender, ironically, uh, and that they were looking at people like Pedro Porro has been an all rounder, but seventy million plus versus you know uh, a free transfer. So I do think Real Madrid have interest in in Trent, but I don't think it's as uh, as big as some people might want it to be. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see what happens uh, on that front. Um, my update here is to tell you: Hey, did you you know hear about the the PSG link? It's a new one. Uh, it was liquid, very speculative. I don't usually pay much attention to them, but PSG have come out fairly quickly to say this this isn't true. Do you know what I mean? Uh, and I I just think it's I think it's the agent run me a bath. I think it's him. You know, just uh, trying to put pressure on Liverpool. Uh, and it's, it's a case of who's going to win. I, I think Liverpool win with the Mo Salah uh, transfer negotiations. I do. I really do because I just don't see anybody else that's out there willing to pay our our offer, our salary, if you like, whatever that is, uh, other than the Saudis. And I just don't think he wants to go to Saudi Arabia at the moment, even though we keep seeing these lazy uh, headlines. Now, it wouldn't surprise me if we didn't hear anything. Uh, you know, if we continue to not hear anything, if we continue to not hear anything for a while uh, as, the, as the month rumbles on, it wouldn't surprise me if Run Me A Bath pops up on his social media, maybe not so much with something cryptic in text, which, he's, which he often does, but maybe a cryptic photograph. Do you know what I mean? And uh, who can remember the, the photograph of, um, of Mo Salah with the, the PSG chief um, some time ago? Just happened to be snapped at breakfast or something, was it? I can't remember, you know, what my memory's late. And it just found its way out there. Do you know what I mean? I mean, imagine being, having a, imagine being in a situation where all this uncertainty is going on. These people, right? When I say people, footballers, agents, even clubs, they all know how to play the media. They know what to do. And I've said it to you for years on here, right? Don't underestimate Mo Salah. We always blame the agents. We always go, ah, it's the agent. It's the agent. Mo knows what he's fucking doing too, trust me. And I don't blame him, it's fine, all right? But just don't be surprised if we, if you don't get the news you want to see soon 
uh, any positive news. I wouldn't be surprised if there was something something else has to come from the uh, Rummy Abaf side, I think. I mean, it could be a picture of Salah somewhere where you go, oh, wonderful. But I don't think so. I think it's more likely to be uh, to be um, Rummy Abaf, something like that. Anyway, that's me speculating. You know, you know, you, ah, well, you seem to like my opinions, and I'm usually right, just saying. They don't say Dunk knows best for fucking no reason at all, do they? I'll leave it with you. So, speculation at the weekend that PSG were in talks with Mo Salah. Speculation that that had been ongoing for some time and wasn't new. Quickly denied by PSG. The source unnamed. Who is that source and why are they saying that? I think it's to apply pressure on Liverpool. And I think Liverpool win that negotiation and that battle against Rummy Abaf. If you appreciate this video, please thumbs up the video. Please drop me a comment. And if you want to buy me a coffee. You can hit the super thanks under the video. I'll see you on here later today. Try and make Saturday afternoon as well if you can. Oh, yeah.